There are a lot of local activities to do here in Mehongsan. In 1995, a healthy mud source was discovered at Pong Duet, Masanga, or the person named Pu Klon by a group of French and Thai geological researchers who went sightseeing in Mehongsan. A stream of hot mineral water was found rising in the middle of rice fields. Many people recovered from illness and pain when soaked in the warm water in the creek. In 1996, the mud from the hot spring was sampled and laboratory proved for minerals at Thermalium Luxel Laboratoire in France. It took four years to find out the useful minerals and natural substances. Being rare minerals, they can be found only at a few places on Earth. And it just takes only, uh -huh. we'll wait only 15 minutes. Uh -huh. Right. How do you feel now? Uh, uh, on your face? It's very cold. Cold, yeah, it's cold. Yeah. And oh, I, I can't just speak and smile. We cannot move much yeah. the mouth. But we just wait 15 minutes and then they will peel uh, it off? Not peel, it's, it's washing. I'll wash, okay. Yeah. And then we'll look 10 years younger. Yeah. Here at Bajabo in Pamapa district, we can come stay with local friends. There are homestay rooms with affordable prices and also we can have a lot of fun activities with our local friends as well. Like today, I'm going to have lunch by cooking local food with our new friends. I'm going to have like local soup, uh, litchi soup and local chili and bean paste. And of course, from here when you sit and have lunch, you can watch the magnificent view on the mountain from Ban Chabo. <laughs> Local experiences include trekking, cloth weaving, and learning about how to make local musical instrument, which is can. In the morning time, you should come here to do some rafting. This is like bamboo raft that will go around this reservoir, Bang Um, for about half an hour. And the atmosphere in the morning is really, really nice and calm. Actually, this reservoir was built under the royal project called Bang Tong, which is nearby, initiated by King Pumikon of Thailand. Previously, the landscape was not like this, but because of the Royal Projects, we started to have this kind of uh, landscape, like water and pine trees. So it's open for public now, and we can come here to enjoy the beautiful scenery. Just five kilometers drive from Pai's downtown and here I arrived at Yunnan Cultural Village or Muban Sandi Chon. Here it's different from other Chinatowns you may have known. Let's see together why. This is similar to Li Jing and Suher in Yunnan. This village is a mix of Chinese Yunnan people and Thai Hu tribe people. And uh, they speak fluently both Thai and Chinese. They live in these clay houses. You can see it's quite a unique architecture here. And uh, it's quite amazing to see this living cultural village here in Thailand.
About half a century ago, King Pumipon visited Mahong San and initiated riot projects to help local people make a living by growing coffee, fruits, and vegetables instead of opium. Nowadays, not only does Mahong San produce their own coffee, but there are also several nice cafes serving local coffee and bakeries. ในหมวดมันจะมาคับให้เราทุกอย่างต้องเร็วหมดใช่ไหมครับขับรถก็ต้องเร็วทุกอย่างจะวุ่นวายหมดแต่เข้ามาที่นี้ด้วยสภาพเมืองที่เป็นอย่างเงี้ยมันจะมาคับให้เราเลยว่าคุณไม่ต้องเร่งรีบก็ได้คุณช้าๆมีเวลาแย่ๆ Let's come and enjoy slow life in Maslin The great thing in Mae Hong Son is that you can always have nice coffee with a very nice view One of the attractions around Pai is, of course, Pai Canyon or Gong Lan in the local language. And this place is located about 8 kilometers from Pai downtown along the road to Chiang Mai. A visit to the canyon is worth your time as it is an outstanding natural attraction with lovely nature walks and its surroundings. As a local, I can tell you that the best time to come here is the evening time because you can witness the stunningly beautiful sunset. Pai Walking Street is open every day from early evening until late at night. So you can come here to enjoy shopping, a lot of handicrafts, handmade products, local products, and a lot of food. Mmm! It's really good. Fresh. This shop is very interesting because they sell clothes, bags, souvenirs, coffee, cakes, breakers, Thai cuisine, and pizza. On this street, you should try this special drink. It's called bamboo tube juice, so they have plenty kinds to choose from. Ginger, lemongrass, pandan, jasmine mint tea, Chrysanthemum or even Chanum Yen or Thai iced tea and you can refill it with only 10 baht You know Western food in Thai is also very good Miracle Thailand is here for you My friends just come Fly to Mae Hong Son from Chiang Mai with Bangkok Airways. Stay tuned for the next episode. Please subscribe.